Well, it's been a week of nonstop borderland hospitality for these Sumble teams, Pitt and Stanford. And a big part of that includes Fort Bliss. KTSM 9 News reporter Tatiana Favela has their experience on post. Well, it's clear the football players from the University of Pittsburgh and Stanford got a first-hand experience on a different type of field, learning what our fighting men and women do for our country at Fort Bliss. I've always had a respect for our military, but just a newfound respect, seeing all the work and time and effort that they put in to, to protect us and the people of our country. It's, it's, it's amazing. Taking some time off the football field, the football players for the University of Pittsburgh and Stanford got to spend time with those in uniform fighting for our country. So to be able to come here and kind of experience um, like the mecca for brotherhood in terms of military, and the bonding that has to occur to be um, a unit, I think it's really cool for us to be here and kind of experience that and experience that with each other. Taking tours on post, players got to get an interactive experience by taking a look inside military training simulators and tanks used on the battlefield. Hey, I got to chance to go outside and actually sit in the tank and put a helmet on and that was amazing. I felt like I was actually out there even though I know it's nothing like being out there. But this has been super cool. I tried to sit in the driver's seat and I did not fit so if you're over 6, 600 pounds you're not going to fit in the seat. While breaking new barriers, these teammates are also building memories to take back home with them. It brings us on closer, allows us to expand our mindset, expand our view of the world, and just have something special that we'll remember for the rest of our lives. Many players tell me it was their first time having an experience like this and now have a better understanding of what kind of work military members do for on their field. Tatiana Favela, KTSM 9 News.